So when Paul talks about the Christian armor in Ephesians 6 uh, and starts out by saying, put on the Christian armor, uh, it's very easy for people to take from that that it's really up to me, uh, that I have to put on these distinct pieces of armor, and if I put these pieces of armor on, uh, then I will be able to stand, and, uh, and therefore my sanctification is really up to me. Uh, people often think about it in terms of mathematical formula, that sanctification is 100% God and 100% me, uh, which is not good mathematics to begin with, and also I think really doesn't do justice to the nature of the sanctification process. Uh, yes, God is active in the sanctification process, thoroughly so, uh, and uh, it is his work from beginning to end. Uh, and it is he, he who enables us to strive, to fight, to endure, uh, to carry on that battle. Uh, so God is sovereign and he does that sovereign work through us. Uh, and it's not uh, as if it's up to us uh, and uh, our standing or falling rests on how well we put on these pieces of armor. This armor is not first and foremost our armor. It's first and foremost the armor that, that Christ has worn for us in our place uh, that now he hands on to us uh, to follow in his footsteps.